Hey you guys, today I wanted to share with you a very quick and easy salad dressing recipe. And all you're going to need is a half a cup of mayo. You can use regular mayo or you can do a, a vegan mayonnaise. You can do a low sodium, low fat mayo, whatever you have on hand. So about a half a cup of that. You're gonna need some apple cider vinegar. And what you'll do is you'll just pour in about that much. Um, you you want to do this to taste and you also want to do it to thickness so if you want it to be more thick use less apple cider vinegar if you want it to be more of a, a loose dressing use a little bit more so I usually do about about that much and now what you're gonna do is you're gonna add your curry alright so that's about a teaspoon of curry there I really enjoy the curry flavor it just balances so nicely with the vinegar and then just a dash of, of cumin. Now you're going to see when you first start mixing this up, it's going to look a little weird um, because obviously the, the mayonnaise and the vinegar is going to, you know, kind of get a little chunky, separate. At first it's going to look a little bit strange, but just keep mixing because you will eventually get it nice and smooth. If you have a hand mixer, you can use that as well. I absolutely love this salad dressing over nice fresh veggies, some lettuce, some tomato. It's absolutely delicious on a salad. Okay, so now that's still a little bit chunky. So if you have a little, little guy like this, you can go on in and whisk it nice and smooth. Nice and easy. I'm just adding now just a little bit of pepper, a little bit of black pepper. You can add more if you'd like. And that's it, you guys. Quick and easy. Quick and easy. I discovered this recipe because I was out of um, my regular salad dressing, and I said, you know what, let's give this a try. I whipped this up, came up with this recipe, and I, uh, I haven't gone back since. It tastes delicious. I just licked my fingers. It's absolutely delicious. I hope you guys give it a try and stay tuned for the next video.